Maria, would you like to watch the story of Arnold the Wise Old Elephant? Sure, Grandma. Let's do it. Priscilla was a hummingbird with wings of red and green. She was the most attractive bird that you have ever seen. But one morning, quite by accident, she tripped and hit her head. And then she thought she had become an elephant instead. Priscilla was the strangest little elephant around. She was one inch tall when standing on the ground. When she tried to trumpet loudly, all she managed was a tweet. And she stirred a little dust up when she stomped her tiny feet. I'm enormous, said Priscilla. I need room to walk around. So she left the shady jungle and set off for open ground. On she went until she heard a funny distant laugh. <laughs> so she looked up and discovered it was Jaden the giraffe. You're an elephant, said Jaden with great wonder in his eye. Yes, that's why I'm walking, said Priscilla. You know elephants can't fly. You're an elephant, said Jaden. Are you sure of this, I mean? You are really rather tiny and your legs are very lean. Yes, it's true. I am an elephant, replied the little bird. So stop all this talk and start to walk and take me to the herd. Across the plain went Jaden with Priscilla close behind till they found some big gray elephants. They weren't too hard to find. This is Arnold. He's the leader, Jaden said. He's very wise. He can tell your grandma's name by the color of your eyes. Glad to meet you, replied Arnold. Would you like to hear me tweet? I'm a hummingbird, you know, and my voice is very sweet. You're a what? replied Priscilla. I don't understand at all. Did you hit your head this morning? Have you had a nasty fall? I'm a hummingbird, said Arnold. I'm pretty and I'm light. When I flit among the flowers, I am such a gorgeous sight. Arnold swung himself into a tree and balanced on a limb. He smiled and checked to see if every eye was watching him. I'm a pretty bird, he warbled as he clumped and clomped around. Then he caused a major earthquake when he jumped back to the ground. You are mad, exclaimed Priscilla. Listen hard while I explain or you'll end up making great big holes across this wide flat plain. An elephant is large and gray with legs like trunks of trees. It flips its ears like two big fans to make a steady breeze. So you see, you silly elephant, my advice I hope you've heard. You are definitely, definitely really not a bird. Then tell me please, said Arnold. If these things you say are right, can you tell me what a bird is? For I'm in a dreadful plight. Well, Priscilla said with pleasure. I'd be glad to help you out. I will tell you what a bird is so you won't have any doubt. A bird is small with feathers and a beak fixed to its head. And it makes its nest up trees and lays eggs in its own bed. Well, if that's the case, said Arnold, and if what you say is true, I'm thinking your description sounds an awful lot like you. With a jolt, Priscilla realized the elephant was right. And the truth of what wise Arnold said gave her a scary fright. <gasps> well, I must be off. She mumbled, blushing rosy red. Then she turned her tail and in a flash, she very quickly fled. It matters what you believe, Maria. No matter how sincere you are, truth is truth. Little Priscilla and wise old Arnold were sincerely wrong. She was not an elephant, and he was not a bird. The Bible always tells the truth. It's best to believe what the Bible says than to go through life mixed up like Priscilla and Arnold. <laughs>